Oh yeah, we're playing Minish Cap. Right. Oh my god, we're streaming. We're playing video games. Oh my god, I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I was getting so into five different conversations there. Um, but yeah. Uh, file two. Oh, I have to name my file. No, 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 no worries at all. It's all good. We haven't even started the game yet, which is totally fine. Okay, yo. My name is Oof. I am Egg. Oh my god, this is so hard to see on my screen. Oh my god, my screen is so bright. Why? It looks good on stream, but for me... Can I tone down the brightness on this thing? This is, like, ridiculous. Like, right now on my screen, like, I can barely see the white lettering on the green. Like, the green is, like, so bright that, like, I can't see the white very well. That's probably not good. Um... Can I do it with this remote? I think I can. Let me see if I can, like, tone this down a bit, because this is ridiculous. Uh, colors... Uh... Oh, there's color tones? Let's try this, maybe? Normal. No. Cool? No. 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 Okay, wait. <laughs> Custom? Oh, brightness? Do I want brightness or contrast here? Maybe contrast is what I want? I'm actually not sure what I want here. Okay, brightness is not helping at all. <laughs> it's not brightness. I need something... What? What's the setting I need to do to make this color, like, not mesh like this? Uh... Maybe contrast? I don't know, let's try 82. Okay, it's definitely not that. <laughs> you guys are not even seeing anything, because, like, the capture card's not affected by my TV. Sharpness? That's not helping. Uh, okay. What else is there? Color? Maybe? Oh, whoa, okay, wait. Interesting. Okay, I just dropped the color a lot, now I can see it very well, but like... But now there's like no color, <laughs> almost. Okay, maybe I, maybe I could strike a balance here a bit. Maybe like... Wow, I was on like super high on the color, that's why. Oh man, why were my colors so vibrant this whole time? Maybe like 25? Okay, now it looks like my capture card quite a bit, actually. But now it looks faded though. <laughs> it's so weird. How can I how can I make it match the stream? Like I don't I wanted to still be colorful, but not like I think this is good enough. Yeah, this is fine. Okay. You guys are like not even seeing anything. I'm just it's just me right now. Tint. Oh, I wonder if that does anything too. But anyway, okay. Alright, I think I'm good with that. At least I can actually read the name now. Alright. Um Oh shoot, thank you for changing all that stuff, Welsh. <laughs> My bad. Um... <laughs> Change this category to just chatting, yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> My leg. <laughs> I just saw this OE right away and I was like, oh yeah, that's definitely... Prime... Oh, I can also put this. Gasping mouth. Uh... Wait, colon! Colon D. Colon 3! <laughs> the possibilities are endless. Oh, you have the small ones, too. <gasps> oh. Uh... Hey. <laughs> uh, okay, wait, let's see... How many characters are there, by the way? One, two, three, four, five. Oh, nice, you can fit that boy perfectly. Let's go, okay. Uh... Date, date, boy. that boy. <laughs> Raccoon Dog, thank you for the 16 month resub, dude. <laughs> Appreciate it. 
Y'all got fun. Thank you, thank you. Hope you're doing well. Uh, my leg. <laughs> I love this hell yeah. <laughs> Don't worry. I like I like just seeing you. <gasps> I like seeing you all too. Thank you. Yes, I'm doing quite well. We just uh, air quote beat F zero. I didn't. I guess I technically didn't beat it, but I did beat every league on standard. But apparently, you gotta beat all the leagues on expert for it to roll the credits. So, uh. We're calling it beaten for now. But, uh. Oh, yeah, I should do the gasping. Right? Like this. That boy! <laughs> Alright, here we go. Perfect. Nice. Oh, are we going? Oh, never mind. Okay. It saved the file, though. <laughs> Thank you. Perfect. Okay. Yo, look at Link go. Look at the animation. It's so fluid. That's what I'm saying. Like, this is probably like one of the most uh, pretty Game Boy Advance games. Like, look at that. There's so many frames of animation there. I was like, I know exactly how many frames that is. <laughs> uh, okay. Options. Oh, message speed fast. Yes. Oh, and just brightness. Wait. I could have set it to dark this whole time in game! I got baited! It made me change my TV settings when they had a built-in darker brightness. That's why, okay. Um, the correct choice. <laughs> Looking forward to this with your love of the Capcom Game Boy characters? Yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited. I, I'm looking forward to it. All right, let's do it. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Start. <laughs> All right. Dang, it's already almost nine. What the heck? Time's flying. All right, we're probably gonna play about an hour and a half. A long, long time ago, when the world was on the verge of being swallowed by shadow. Da, 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 da. The tiny pickery appeared from the sky, bringing the hero of men a sword and a golden light. With wisdom and courage, the hero drove out to the darkness. <gasps> when peace had been restored, the people enshrined that blade with care. The sword. It's the sword. Oh my god. This is quite enjoyable, Zelda. Nice. <gasps> Logs. Any frogs on that log? <gasps> It's Saldo. Whoa, she can move diagonal. Okay, diagonal movement confirmed. <laughs> this is my house. Whose house is this? Oh, blacksmith. Good morning, Master Smith. Goodness me, Princess Zelda. Hey, what the hell are you doing here? Did you sneak out of the castle and come all this way alone? The minister should be worried about you. You know how he gets. Oh, don't worry about him. He'll be fine. Where's that boy? <laughs> the whole town is bustling for the annual Pickery Festival. I thought he and I might go together. Would you mind terribly? Oh, is that what you're here for? Well, that boy was up late helping me last night and he's still asleep. <gasps> but I do have an errand at the castle. Yes, that should be fine. That boy, time to get up. Oh shit, what up? <laughs> I'm snoozing. That boy, time to get up. Huh? What? Oh shit, what up? Hello. Roll. Oh, I can roll. Oh yeah, let's go. Oh, we can't diagonal roll, but we can move diagonally though. I have no sword. That's why Master Smith is here to give me a sword, right? Ooh, rolling's gonna be addicting. <laughs> bye, bye, tiny minish cap guy. <laughs> Lawrence got it. You ever just wake up and immediately do a somersault? <laughs> yeah, all the time. Get the juices flowing from the get-go. Frame one, out of bed. Hey, that boy. Princess Zelda's here. She'd like to know if you join her at the festival. Yeah, that boy. Come on, let's go check out the festival together. Master Smith already gave me permission to take you. 
Yes, after all, the festival only comes once a year. Go on, have fun. While you're there, you can do me a favor. I just finished making the sword for the minister at Hyrule Castle. I'd like you to deliver it to him. Yeah. You accepted the smith's sword. Make sure you don't lose an extremely important delivery. <laughs> okay, I mean, this is just foreshadowing, probably, but all right. This is the blade that will be presented to the winner of the competition. Don't lose it. And while the two of you may be childhood friends, remember, Zelda's the princess of Hyrule. You watch over her. Don't let anything bad happen to her. Oh man, double foreshadowing. Oh great. Master Smith, quit worrying. We'll be perfectly safe. Come on, Dad Boy. Let's go check out the festival. Can I use the sword first? Just kidding. It's not my sword. I gotta deliver the sword. It's in the chest though. Yo, rupees. That's great. <laughs> okay, I love how that hasn't really changed. Oh, you can lift it with R. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, the, the rupee messages are like so funny. It was like Link's Awakening had the same thing. I think it was Link's Awakening, where you'd open the, the chest and depending on what it would, how many rupees were in it, it would just say like a message after. That boy over here. Oh, she's jumping up and down. All right. Uh. Eh. 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 Nothing here. Yo, an axe. Can I jump off like this? Oh, we can. Nice. That boy, hurry, let's go. Over here, come on, hurry up. I'm chill. I, I, I'm rolling twice. I'm heading your direction. Well, here we are, the town of Hyrule. Yeah. Festival! Let's go! Here we are, that boy. Doesn't it look fun? Come on, let's look around. Huh. Welcome to the Pickery Festival. They say that every hundred years, the Pickery come to Hyrule. This is the hundredth year to the day since the last time the Pickery were here. Damn. That's cool. Okay. Phew, preparing for the festival left me absolutely exhausted. So I'm just enjoying watching people have fun. Hell yeah. You enjoying yourself, that boy? is the biggest festival in Hyrule. If you don't stop to enjoy it, you'll miss out on all the fun. They say the Pickery bring happiness to all the humans they meet. Or bring happiness. Whoops. I wonder when they will bring happiness to me. <gasps> they will. Don't worry. Trust. Oh, Zelda's over here. Hold up. Looking around. You ever just wake up and immediately do a somersault off your ledge and hang out with your princess bestie? <laughs> I wish. Is this just Chrono Trigger? I was thinking the same thing. I said it in my head. I didn't want to be annoying about it, but yeah. I was like, doesn't Chrono Trigger start with a festival? Like, what's going on here? Come one, come all. Try your luck and win incredible prizes. All right. How? I want to play. Okay, they're not going to let me play. Yo, is this Beetle? That's Beetle, right? Oh, hi, are you enjoying the festival? It's so much fun. I'm so happy to be here. And my fresh fruits are just delicious. Buy some. I, I wish I can, but it's not letting me. All right, what about you? Just my way back from seeing the tournament at Hyrule Castle. Let me tell you, watch all those sword fights made me hungry. This guy looks like a broccoli. Come on up, come one, come all. Gather around, have a look-see. I'm having a huge sale on all manner of delicious and festive vegetables. Ah, that explains why you look like a broccoli. Day and night, he's going on and on about Pickery this and Pickery that. Doesn't he know they're nothing but a silly fairy tale to make kids behave? Uh, this is my first ever Pickery festival. So, where are all the Pickery anyway? Uh, I don't know. Oh uh, wait, did I talk to her? I don't think I did. Each year there's a sword fighting tournament at the Pickery Festival. This year's tournament is already over. Can not believe how fast it went? I hear the victor was a mysterious man dressed entirely in black. Okay. Uh, interesting. I love festivals. It's like seeing your town transform into another world. It really gives you a chance to think about how well we have it here. You're the boy from Old Master Smith's place, right? I'm sure you know this, but he's the best swordsman the Hyrule's ever seen. Every year under the tournament trying to win with that sword of his. Oh. Haven't won yet. Haven't won yet, and maybe I never will, but the tournament was awesome. Where is here was a new face. I've been wondering where he's from. He used some incredible techniques and won the whole tourney in record time. This, this guy's mysterious. 
Only once every hundred years is the mystic doorway open. This is the door that links the human world to the world of the Pickery. When this door opens, the Pickery can enter our world. And guess what? This marks the hundredth year! I'm sure something wonderful is gonna happen. Yeah. Hey, guy, have you ever seen the Pickery? I saw one just the other day. It wore a red cone-shaped hat and it was really small. It was standing inside my dad's shoe. I really saw it, I swear. Never seen the Pickery before. Okay. Oh, wait, I didn't even notice you. I've been on the road for a while. I came back in time for the festival. It feels wonderful to be back in Hyrule again in this joyous time. I... I must put these feelings into verse. Oh, God. Okay, I thought she was about to go sing or do poetry right now. I think I'll really see the Pickery if I'm on my best behavior all the time. Maybe. Long, long ago, and then even long before that. <laughs> Evil creatures appear in the world of humans. They are powerful, frightening beasts, and they create such trouble. But then Pickery came from the sky, bringing humans powerful magic. The magic lay forest and the Pickery lay the beasts were repelled. In the world of humans, once more, new peace, thanks to the Pickery. So it's not to forget our gratitude, we hold this festival each year. Now remember, little ones, the Pickery only appeared before good little children. If you only do bad deeds, you'll never get to see them, so be good. I don't believe in the Pickery. I'm not a kid anymore. I'm too old to believe in any stupid old fairy tale. All right, what do you think, Zelda? That boy, there's a storyteller here. We should stop and listen to... Oh, I wonder what's over there. <laughs> okay. He's like, ooh, a piece of candy. Ooh, a piece of candy. So the Pickery are real. My father always told me they were. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Zelda, you're so silly. Say, wasn't there going to be a sword fighting tournament at the castle? I wonder who won this year. Oh, wow, over here. <laughs> Jesus Christ. This having so much fun. Oh, ring, ring, ring. Oh, she won. We have a winner. Oh my, Princess Zelda, you won the grand prize in our drawing? Wow. You get your choice of any of these wonderful prizes. What will it be? <gasps> First, we have this lovely heart-shaped stone. Oh, oh, oh. I want it. Next, we have... Oh, rupees. It's a magnificent gem. And finally, there's... <gasps> this teeny tiny shield. Okay. What do you, which one do you want, Zelda? Please, pick pick wisely. Let me guess, the jewel? Oh, but this Hearthstone is very cute, too. Choose whatever one you'd like. Oh, she took the shield! Let's go! Shield is so adorable, I think I'll take it. What? Why? Why would you want that ugly thing? What about the Hearthstone? It's cute. Or, or this giant gem, it's pretty. Honestly, they're both much nicer than the nasty little shield thing. I want the shield. Can I have it? <laughs> what a strange princess you are. What's, what's wrong with why the shield? Well, okay, here's your teeny tiny shield. Here, I want to give you a present. Aww. Does the shield suit you perfectly, that boy? Hell yeah. Hold the button to protect yourself. Which button? The button. It is a little embarrassing, though. It's so tiny. It's good enough. Just as I thought, you look great. Now if anything happens, you can protect me with that shield. Yes. Oh, I almost forgot, we have to take Master Smith's sword to the castle. Let's go, that boy. Okay, so it's on A right now. <laughs> protect. Uh, so can I move this button? Oh, I can, okay, so that's the same. Cool. Uh, do I want that on A? I think I want that on B. Okay, you can save anywhere? Really? I guess that's normal too. Pieces of heart, Smith's Blade. Oh, sleep mode on my CRT. Nice. Okay, um, sounds good. Uh, let's go. Oh, the kids are gone. Oh, lots more people. Oh, there's a, the boogie kid. Not the boogie kid again. So, 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 I've been good all year, like, all year long. And you know how the Pickery only shows us if you've been good? And so, so, I'm just waiting for the Pickery to come and play with me. <laughs> that booger is so long. <laughs> oh, I've never seen the Pickery before. Neither have I. Hey guys, have you ever seen the Pickery? I saw one just the other day. Oh, this is the same two kids from earlier. They're saying the same thing. Oh, new characters. 
Sister and I came a long way to see the Pigry Festival this year. Is it true the festival is named after tiny people the size of my thumb? I want to see what they look like. Do you know where I can go to see them? Eh. People from all over the place come to Hyrule Town for the Pigry Festival. They sure do. <gasps> There's a bird! Burb. What's a burb? Oh, another burb. Blue burb, yellow burb. <laughs> she just like me for real, for real. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Josh? Welcome in. Dispatch from Hyrule Castle up north to the wa to watch the. Bleh. Rewind. I've been dispatched from Hyrule Castle up north to watch over the festivities. Okay, cool story, bro. Oh, Hyrule Castle. All right. Special livery. Oh, come on, that boy. Let's turn to the castle. She's so fast. She runs like f f as fast as my rolling. <gasps> no! Deku scrub! The business scrub. How dare you! They were saying a Deku scrub had been hassling all the passers by? That boy, do something about it, otherwise we can't get to the castle. Look at some way to defend ourselves against those nuts of his. Oh, you mean. Ha! Take that. Please forgive me, sir! I heard there was a festival and I came to town open to hawk my wares. Fortunately, we scrubs have a tendency to spit nuts when we speak. Everyone got scared right away and no one would buy anything. This is a terrible place to do business. I'm going back to my cave. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Chilling, my brother. How's the vibe tonight? The vibe is immaculate. As always. Can't go wrong with some Zaldo, man. Yes, yes, sir. Yeah, first time playing Minish Cap. Um, I love, I love me some 2D Zeldas, and uh, yeah, I'm, I'm excited to see how this one goes. Won't be hassling anymore. Better hurry to the castle. Alright, let's go. I shall protect you from now on. No more Deku Scrub will hit you. Royal Valley. Oh, okay, that hurts. Don't touch that. Interesting. Wait, can I get a heart? No. Okay. Alright, I just gotta go this way. There's our drawbridge. Little guards. Welcome to Hyrule Castle! Ah, oh, Princess Zelda! Wh when did you leave the castle? Pfft. These guards suck, they don't even realize when Zelda leaves. Maybe she snuck out. Sorry, we're getting things ready for the ceremony. I can't let you pass. Oh, but the maze looks fun. Alright, I guess we'll just keep on going up. The sword for the award ceremony. You should take that to Minister, Minister Potho. You'll find him in front of the castle. Okay, oh, there he is, I think. <laughs> Preparation for the award ceremony. Come along nicely. Alright, what's up, Minister? Oh, that boy, you brought the sword, did you? Then as minister to the kingdom of Hyrule, I, Potho, accept this blade. You came just in time. The award ceremony would begin soon. I'm sorry, that boy, but I better go. I have to prepare for the ceremony. Had a good time at the festival. Thanks for coming with me. Thank you. That was fun. Since you're here, that boy, why don't you join us for the award ceremony? Sounds good. The sword! Do you know about that sword, that boy? <laughs> it's called the Pickery Blade, and it looks much evil away in that chest. Or locks much evil away. I thought some looks. <laughs> the Pickery Blade is sacred among the people of Hyrule, and the legend has it that long ago the Pickery gave us this blade. Whoever wins the competition has the honor of touching the sacred blade. Oh, this music. What? <laughs> Link to the past music? Okay. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Let the award ceremony commence. This is the king, I guess? Vati, champion of the competition. You may approach the blade. This is the person in black. Oh. How about there? Poiple hair? Blue hat? <laughs> Oh, hmm. <laughs> well, <laughs> I wonder who's the evil person in this game. <laughs> <laughs> to think things would go this well. 
Hickory blade and the bound chest spoken of in Hylian lore. This chest must hold that which I seek. I'll relieve you of its contents now. Oh, another defensive. They know. Oh, shit. <laughs> Body just yeeted them. <gasps> mm -hmm. <laughs> Do not interfere with me. As Victor, I've earned the right to approach the Pickery Blade. I've been waiting for this moment. Oh, shit. He's command mailing. Oh! Yoink. Uh. Well, there goes the evil that was locked away. <laughs> oh, Zelda with the shield. Let's go. Who are you? Why are you doing this? The princess with the mist. Oh, wait, that was, that was her saying that. <laughs> Whoops, I couldn't tell. The princess with the mystic aura. The power that was gifted to the people of Hyrule still flows within the veins of the ladies of its royal family? Interesting. If I leave you now, you'll only cause me trouble later. That will never do. <gasps> to stone with you! The shield doesn't protect me. Well, shit. <laughs> Well, game over. <laughs> All who stand in my way shall share this fate. Now to find out what power awaits me in this chest. What? Empty? There was nothing in there but a rabble of monsters? What is the meaning of this? Well, I know the force I'm after is somewhere out there. I'm in no hurry. I can take my time searching for it. <laughs> <laughs> What? They just poofed away. What is this? Oh, it was all a dream. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> uh, I actually never played this one, but I recently started seasons again. Oh, nice, dude. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we we're just talking about seasons and ages and yeah, they're they're awesome. They're they're my personal favorite Zelda games, but only because they're the first ones I played. So like I I'm like biased towards the the nostalgic Zelda games for me, but yeah, used to play them in elementary school. I still have my copies over there. Um, but yeah, so I'm uh I'm excited to keep on playing these awesome 2D Zeldas. All right, wake up. Frame one somersault. Oh, <laughs> wait! I didn't even realize he does a flip out of the bed too. I thought you were just referencing the fact that I was just rolling out of bed, but like he literally flips out of the bed too. That's kind of crazy. Link is built different, man. Or Toon Link, specifically, anyway. Thank goodness! You've awakened! Master Smith is here as well! He's come to see His Majesty the King! Dang, it was not just a dream? Shit. Oh, that boy! You're awake! Are you feeling alright? Stand at my side. The King of Hyrule is about to speak. It is as you have all heard. A sorcerer named Vati has cursed my fair Zelda and turned her to stone. If we had the sacred Pickery Blade, we likely could have broken the curse. But Vati shattered the blade. However, I have not given up hope. What do you know about the Pickery? The Pickery? Not much beyond what the fairy tales say. They're supposed to be very tiny, if I remember correctly. Yes, the ones from the fairy tales. But the Pickery are no mere legend. They most certainly exist. No one outside of the royal family knows the truth about them. The Pickery who forged the sacred blade lived deep within Minish Woods. They should be able to repair the broken blade and reforge the sword. W what? Then we must dispatch the soldiers at once! No, soldiers will not do. The Pickery do not show themselves to anyone but children. Our soldiers can search for days and still find no sign of them. I see. If that's the case, then why not send that boy? If that boy has recovered, then yes. I would like to ask this of him. Please turn my precious Zelda back to normal. Pickery should know how to create a new sacred sword. It will be a dangerous journey now that those monsters have been freed. Please take this sword with you, along with the broken Pickery blade. <gasps> da -da -da -da! That's not. Wait, where's the other sword? Hey, da -da -da -da! Smith sword. It's the, the the sword that I wanted to use, but I have to deliver. But they're gonna just give it to me anyway. Hell yeah! It's a sharp blade made by your grandfather. Very well then, send the soldiers to search for Vati at once. Deep within the Minish Woods, you will find a place called Deep Wood Shrine. Once humans and Pickery shared that shrine as a meeting place, I think it would be best if you started your search there. Take this map with you. 
If you get lost on your way to the forest, simply check your map. Just press start and then L or R to open the map. I've marked the location of the forest for you. Good luck and be careful. You got the thing. Now I'll never get lost. Uh, <laughs> I'll find a way. All right, Zelda games. I'm, I'm gonna get lost. Uh, okay, so it's in the corner and we're up here. Okay. Oh, this is a pretty. This is a pretty small map. I'm assuming this is not the only. Like this is not. How small the map is. This is just like our area we're in right now, probably. Count on you, dad boy. Only you can break Vati's curse and free Princess Zelda. All right, sounds good. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I can't, uh, I can't spin slash yet. Okay. Wait, I'm curious. Oh, never mind. Okay. Uh, press R while walking to roll. Yeah, yeah. That sword, yeah, that boy got that sword. I wonder if there's like more stuff in the castle. There might be more. But I'm just gonna go to the forest. Hyrule Castle Garden. I'm trying to get the timing down for the rolling. Oh, the music. The Zelda music. <gasps> Octorok. Oh, hell yeah, we're Wii zelda now. Can we slash this? Wait, I want to try the shield. Hey, Octorok. Oh, the birds. No, not the birds. Oh, okay. It doesn't bounce back. Rocks are too powerful. All right. Do, 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 Oh, the double shot. I didn't know they could do that. Oh, heart. You got a heart, they replenish your life. You got a rupee, it's green, don't spend it all in one place. <laughs> so funny game. Uh, okay. Yo, this guy's chopping. Wait, what's going on here? Huh? That sorcerer was something else. He really tore up the town, so we got a serious backlog of work to do. <gasps> he said backlog. That's what we're doing. Creepy, it's like all these monsters just appeared out of nowhere. Oh, did they just destroy the town? Oh no. The name's Mudo. I'm head carpenter around these parts. The King of Hyrule himself has entrusted me with this project. See that sorcerer's attack tore th uh that sorcerer's attack tore things up pretty bad around here. No kidding, you shouldn't be playing anywhere near the construction zone. Oh, no time to talk, kid! Bosses is working our fingers to the bone! No time for a break even! Oh no. Oh, it's blocked. I can't even go this way. I'm so busy! So busy! Gotta finish here so I can go repair the steps next. Huh, okay. So that pickery blade was just a lock keeping those monsters in that chest? Rumors that Vadi was looking for something inside the chest. I mean, something other than monsters, but nobody knows for sure what it is. I tell you, he sure has been nothing but a big headache to the rest of us. Mm-hmm. <laughs> when, when you streaming. <laughs> go across that yet. Okay, I gotta go to the bottom right is where I need to head. So let's see if I can go that way. Um, not quite. I'll go this way though. Alright, here we go. Lon Lon Ranch. Oh. <gasps> I'm in the hole. <laughs> it's pretty goofy. Oh. Whoa. Wait, what is this? <laughs> It's like the Goomba stack. What the heck? I don't want to hurt these things because they just look so funny, but... Wait, so if I... Oh no! Oh, they're like little mole guys. It's interesting. <laughs> minions? <laughs> they did kind of look like minions. What the heck? <laughs> Vale Falls, Minish Woods, Lake Hylia. Oh. Okay. To me, they look like ninja ducks or chicks or something, but, uh... Yeah, I can see the minion now. I cannot see it. Uh, okay. Uh... I'm gonna just let them live their life. 
Mitch was like far to the south from here. If you get lost, check your map. Oh, that boy, you're in Mitch Woods now, aren't you? Leave the monsters that body free to us and go find the pickery. Sounds good. So... I see. So I'm already almost there. Alright. <gasps> Tornado. Mm. Yo, the ranch. Any... Any horses? Oh, there's a cow there. Moo. Let's go see if I can say hi to the cows. I can't even enter the- I can't enter. It's not even letting me enter. Alright, well, I'm going. No cows for us. Octorox. Oh. Rupee. Any doggos eyes emoji? Yeah, where's the blue dog? Surely they're good to be good in this game, right? This house. Oh, classic music. Man, they have all the all the like all the Zelda like notable songs. Oh, you can move them too. Interesting. Why can't you slash the pots though? Literally unplayable. Can I go in the bed? So there's like nothing going on here. Okay. Okay, this seems to be some sort of like bomb wall or something. What's with the holes in those very specific spots? That seems very sus. Okay, so I gotta go this way. Minions. Mitchwoods. Okay, we're almost there. Hey, I made it. Ow. Oh, this music. I've heard this music before. Okay, I'm assuming I can't go in this water. Oh, it's a heart piece. <gasps> yeah, I figured as much. I just wanted to test it for science. I probably need like some sort of fire thing that burns the vines or thorny vines. shock me when I hit him? Or is this a different enemy? I don't remember. Okay, no, it's not this guy. No, this is like the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Never mind. Oh, it's foggy here. <gasps> Why did my footsteps sound like this? Okay, I can't cross here either. Okay, I'm gonna go stretch and get ready for bed, but I will be watching from afar. Sounds good. Have fun, dude. Woo and good luck. Woo. <laughs> Woo and good luck. <laughs> Thank you. Take it easy. Have a good stretch and stuff. I'm just gonna be playing for another year. Maybe hour max. Probably before we have to do like a dungeon or anything like before I have to do anything like super major. Yeah. Oh, the stump. Can I change the seasons? <gasps> I can stand on it. Wait. Is that hinting towards the season rod? Is it back? Oh, that'd be so sick. Help! Help me! 
Is that the Minish Cap? Don't bully the Minish Cap. Ouch! Won't somebody stop them? Ow! Ow! Help! Somebody! Can anybody hear me? Oh no. <gasps> Piece of heart! Click for to make a new heart container for even more life energy! Hell yeah, we got our first piece of heart. Dude, I'm seeing all these like tiny doors and I have to- I need the pickery power, man. I can't- I can't fit in there. Alright, how do I save this poor cap? Where- I got here, but I can't really like progress though. Right? I can't swim. Alright, well then, where do I go? Guess is there any other way I can go? I can't fit in here either. Mm. Oh, oh, they like, spawned back over here. Okay. <laughs> hey, kid, you there? Ow! Hey, don't just stand there. Do something. Ow! What's wrong with you? Do you like watching me take this abuse? Help me! You. Phew! Well done! That was close! Not that I couldn't handle them myself! That's besides the point! What in the world is a lone child doing so deep in the woods? Ho ho! I see! The Pickery, you say? And Vati? Vati's cursed someone? What? The Sacred Blade? Is that so? I see, I see. You know, you and I have quite a lot in common. You see, I too am on a quest to break a curse of Vati's. You said that reforging the sacred blade can break his curse, eh? Well, then you have found yourself a companion, my boy. My name is Ezlo. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. He's gonna follow me? What? Is there something on my face? Quit staring, it's rude! <laughs> Wait! You walk so quickly! Too quickly, in fact! Can't you go any slower? Surely you've noticed that I have no legs. Wait, take a good look at me! Do you really think I walk that fast? Well... <laughs> ah, if this is one thing, it's another! You're a troublesome boy! Oh. Well, now they're just on my head. There! They can't possibly leave me behind. Why, it's quite comfortable up here. More comfortable than it looks, surely. Much easier on me. Hey, quit your squirming! Can't you sit still? See? There! Yes. Yes, that's it. Much better. I suppose a boy like you still has much to learn about the world. If you need my insight, press select. I'd be happy to help. Ah, oh, such a hopeless child. <laughs> and now I have a cap. But it talks. <laughs> so bye bye, Mr. Minish Cap Guy. What? I haven't even had time to settle in. You're bothering me? Deepwood Shrine lies obviously enough deep in the heart of these woods. So says my superior intuitive senses, or sense. Now get a move on. Okay, well, where? Uh, okay. You ever wander the woods and meet someone who just jumps out of your head and tell you to press something? <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, I wish. I wish just as much as uh, wanting a somersault to meet up with the princess. Yeah, all the time, man. <laughs> uh, it happened just this just this past weekend, man. I was I was going to a forest. This guy just said, you know what? I'm gonna be your hat now. This place is dangerous. There's so many monsters. Kid, be careful. You won't let them hurt me. <laughs> uh, so this is not like another okay. I'm gonna just like head back outside of the forest. Oh, hold on for a moment, my boy. We've stumbled across something important. <gasps> a stump. The world of the Minish is very small. You're far too big to meet them now. Eh? Who are the Minish? Ah, uh, yes, silly me. Allow me to explain. You humans call them Pickery, but they refer to themselves as the Minish. Ah. Strange how in the world of humans only this forest has kept that name. Anyhow, deep in the forest, they built a tiny village where many now live. But if we're free, or no, if we're to enter the village, we'll have to make you a touch smaller first. Look at that! At first glance, it appears to be a mere stump, yes? No, that stump is a portal used by people long ago to adjust their size. 
With my help, you can use it to shrink down to minish size. Just stand on the stump and press R to shrink. To return to normal, stand next to a stump and press R. Get me up there, we'll give it a try. Okay, so this is the... <laughs> the, uh... The Rod of Seasons-like thing with the stump. It will happen to be this weekend, who knows, it's New York City. Alright, shrink me. Oh, man. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my goodness. We're like 10 pixels now. Not even. <laughs> the, the zoom in. Welcome to the world through the eyes of the Minish. Now aren't you glad you saved me? Let me thank me, though. Poles that reduce your size are all around in different shapes and sizes. If you want to turn to normal, stand next to a portal, press R. There's one thing you must know. Being Minish size is full of dangers. Mere puddles at your normal size are bottomless swamps of the Minish. As your companion, if anything bad happens to you, it happens to me too. So proceed with caution, my lad. Not for your sake, then for my own. Okay. Yeah, I can still roll. So I can go this way now. There's also a thing up here. Oh, that is what they meant by the puddle. Oh, shoot. Okay. There's also stuff before this, I want to say. <gasps> Lily pad. I'm a froge. Ribbit. 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 Okay. Oh, this is so cool. Let's zoom in. Oh. This acorn's huge. <gasps> Leaf. <laughs> Kero Kero. Kero Kero. Imagine the possibilities of New York City. Literally anything can happen. Oh god, where are we right now? Hmm, it appears we have found the Minish Village. <gasps> it's the Pickery, I mean the Minish. They got the red caps and all. Oh, they even say Pico Pickery. <laughs> Pico Pickery! I guess it's been quite some time since I last saw a human. What's that? You didn't understand what they were saying just now? Oh yes, that was the language of the Minish. It's a little different from the dialogue I'm most familiar with. Uh, I'm afraid I didn't catch most of what they said myself. Perhaps there's something, someone here who understands your language. Let me look around. Alright. Uh... Oh. Interesting. Huh. 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 Oh. What was that noise? Sounds like a... Yo, what's up, Zick? Whoa, thank you for the raid, dude. Hope you had a good stream. What were you streaming today? I know you've been busy with all kinds of stuff between RPG Limit Break and all that. I'm assuming you're on back onto Sly with uh, GDQ coming up soon. Uh, but yeah, I'm Skateman222. Uh, old, retired, not retired, but old, old AF speedrunner. Playing casual games right now. You like Minish Cap, Zick? <laughs> oh, Momodora. Yo, nice. Momodora's dope. Yeah, we're trying to get Sly 3 picked right now, by the way. If you want to vote for it, you can... Uh, you and everyone else can freely vote for Sly or anything else. But Sly is right now second place. Probably soon to be first potentially, depending on how the votes shake out, but I've been trying to vote on Sly as much as possible and a, a couple other people in chat too. Uh, okay. <laughs> Sounds good. Yeah, we I, we gotta get Sly 3 played today, or done today. This year. Today would be nice too, but this year. So I'm, I'm pushing it until it gets picked and then, then I'll be happy to move on to other games. You love this game so much? Oh, nice. Okay, I'm glad to hear that. I was like, a little, I was like semi worried about this game going into it because, um, I've heard that the end game is like brutal as heck, but like outside of that, this game just like looks and sounds phenomenal for a, a GBA game. So like, I'm pretty excited. And like, I love the 2D Zeldas, especially the Oracle games. So like, I'm. I'm excited to, to play through this this month. I'll be playing this off and on this month, probably uh, like once or twice a week, roughly. I'm gonna like alternate bet between this and the other games. But yeah, I, I, I sort of finished F Zero earlier today, so I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna mess around with Zelda for a little bit before I sign off, since I didn't want to 
just do a like a basically two three hour stream of like after a long break away because I was playing TTYD offline pretty much that whole time. Yeah, Momodora, that, that's on my wish list right now. I haven't like gotten, I haven't picked it up yet, but like, I really enjoyed the fourth game, the Momodora 4, so I'm, I'm excited to eventually play that game too. It looks really good. Okay, no one understands me, man. Where, where's the English speaking Minish? Is it just you? Is it just the guy at the very beginning? That would have been funny. Yeah, like I went all the way around and I just completely ignored the very first one. Pico, rico, 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 pico. Oh, maybe you? Oh, wait, no, you? Dang it, dude. <laughs> Get it played before the GDQ run? Yeah, that would be, uh, that would be perfect, if possible. I kind of got a lot of plans going on this month, so... It's probably unlikely that it'll get picked before then, but, uh... We'll see, you never know. You never know with the marbles, man. Like, you could be a favorite, you can have 200 million votes, and, like... Sometimes it just doesn't get picked. Yo! Another piece of heart already! You're gonna get an upgraded heart in, like, not very long at this rate. Okay, we can't swim, so we can't go there. How was TTYD remake? Oh, it was it was awesome. It was super great. I mean, I, I mean, I'm hella nostalgic about that game. So like, I was, I already knew going into it, I was gonna really like it. Um, but um, yeah, it was it was awesome. It was really cool. And it was really, it was really cool to actually like hundred percent everything. Cause like as a as a kid, I never really like a hundred percent it. I played it a bunch. I, I played it like two or three times with my my best childhood friend at the time. We would just like. I would, we would do a sleepover or do like a spring break thing and we just like play through the entire game like from start to finish but I never like went back to play it myself and like fully enjoy everything so this remake was like perfect so I was like oh this gives me like a, a reminder like hey this this exists and like I get to re-experience this and actually try to do everything like the pit of 100 trials and all the other stuff you can do um and uh yeah it was awesome I think the only thing I didn't like about the game was the fact that they like even though they added so much quality of life and awesome stuff to the remake, they went two steps backward by like making the text so slow and unskippable, and the menus were like pretty clunky too. It was it was kind of weird. Um, Cause yeah, you could if you compare how the text scrolls in the remake with the original, it's like night and day. It's like one of them is just like rapid fire, like you can like instant text it, like you can just rapid fire. The remake is just like. Like, <laughs> you can get through like probably four or five text boxes in the original compared to the remake's one text box. So it's like, it's like very anti speedrunner, which is very weird because they added a lot of good stuff for speedrunners to like save time on backtracking. But then the text is like as slow as it is with no like fast text option. Like, it's kind of weird that they missed that, but oh well. That's my only real like nitpick complaint. It's it's bad from a speedrunner angle, but it's so good from everything else. All right. Oh, you can speak English. All right. What's up? I've never seen an outfit like that before. Are you a human? <gasps> How did you know? Is this a problem? Oh my! <laughs> it's been quite some time since any humans came here. My name is Festari. I watch the Abbey as well as the Shrine to the North. You seem to be having some trouble with our language, don't you? You can use a jabberna. It will allow you to understand our tongue. You should be able to find one in the barrel house just south of here. A jabbernut, huh? Okay. Humans? Not the humans, man. Is it barrel house? Um, barrel house. Are you a barrel? Pico rico pico. I said just- oh, here we go. Barrel. <gasps> I love the music. Alright, you probably won't understand me either. So I said it was in a... Oh, puzzle? <gasps> Jabbernut. Oh, that boy! This must be the Jabbernut fish that I told you about. Well, you better eat it before you plan on making any progress at all. You ate the Jabbernut. Now you can understand the language of the Minish. Easy. Yeah, that puzzle was so hard, man. I had to push a block. That was crazy. 
jabber me nut ouchie. <laughs> I... What? Oh my god. Okay, uh, let's go talk to the Pico Rico Nicos now. Wait, they're gone. Why did they disappear? Our ancestors, the ancient Minish, used the portal between our worlds. It brought them into the human world and they settled in this forest. Yo, nice leaf bed. <laughs> SpongeBob, me boy! <laughs> Chatter me nut! <laughs> Where he laughs. <laughs> oh my god, we're going we're getting unhinged. Uh, there's so many monsters around these woods lately. The Elder said that even the Shrine of the North is full of monsters now. So I guess that's gonna be our first dungeon? Shrine of the North. <laughs> Jabbered me nut. <laughs> Shiver me timbers! Oh. Whoa, is this like the Minish Elder? Oh, you speak our language! It's been quite a while since we heard outsiders speak our tongue. We have little to offer you in these woods, but please enjoy your stay. Thank you for your offer, but we have no time to relax. My name is Ezlo. This child is that boy. We need to break a curse that has been cast on the Princess of Hyrule. To do so, we need to reforge the broken Pickery Blade. Ah, yes. You've come here now hoping to have the blade reforged. Hmm, well, if that's what you're after, you'll need four mystic elements. Oh, God. These elements are the crystalline forms of the energies of this world. Only by infusing the blade with these energies can a new blade be forged. Here, give me your map. I can mark where these elements can be found. Bing! And there's our dungeons. Okay, oh, there's one right where we are. Poiple. Okay. The Earth Element can be found in the Shrine to the North of Fistari's Abbey. Okay. Shrine to the North of his Abbey. Okay. Speak with Fistari. He'll show you the path to the Shrine's entrance. Go with caution. Evil creatures have lately made their home in our shrine. Return to me at once after you've found the Earth Element. Okay, so I think th this is... We're probably gonna stop soonish. Assuming that is like the first dungeon, I'm probably gonna like try to get to it and then save in there. We Minish live in Hyrule Town, other places too, not just in these woods. You probably haven't noticed, but uh, lots of Minish live right in Hyrule Town. Wait, what? Really? I'm gonna set to leave for town and visit some of my Minish friends there. Alright. Let us pass. You wish to go to the shrine? Very well, this way. <laughs> We, uh, vile beasts have so settled in recently. Be careful, it's quite dangerous. Oh no. <gasps> I'm so small again. Yeah. Uh, ruining this game the way I did it for myself? Wait, what? <laughs> Tell me why they're hiding bloody knives behind their backs? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you talking about the the Minish guys? Yeah, I was like kind of confused about that. Like, what were what were they holding out with the red like? like I, I I I still don't know what that is. That's pretty funny. But yeah, you've you've now totally ruined it for me. Thank you. Oh, interesting. So that exits. So is this just the first dungeon? Oh dang, we're already there. So this would be the deep wood shrine the Minish Elder spoke of. He said something about there being monsters inside, didn't he? Hey now, no reason to be afraid or anything. I'll be waiting right here. No wait, what am I saying? I'm not letting you leave me alone out here. Hmm. Okay, wait, what time is it? 9.44? Oh, it's not that bad, actually. We can maybe try to do this. I don't know how long this is, though. If this is like a two-hour dungeon, we're gonna be in trouble. But if this is like a... Like a 30-minute to an hour thing, that's probably not that bad. I could probably do it now. Uh, okay, let me save. Just in case I do run out of time, but I think I'll be fine. I'm assuming these are gonna be like mini dungeons in a way, kinda. Oh, the web. Oh no, a very difficult puzzle again. I just love trying with that to this day. Ooh, little slugs. Switches. Compass map, which one? 
Oh, none of the way up, just key. Okay. Wait, do I have the map by default? I saw something here. Okay, no, I'm discovering it as I go, but... Okay. Um... Alright, key. Hmm, there's a locked door here. See if you can find a key to open it. Uh, I'm already ahead of you there. Say my first rodeo with them Zaldo games. Oh no. Okay, I thought <laughs> I thought these slugs were wall masters, but they're just slugs falling from the ceiling. Hey, you see that lever? I think you should be able to pull it. Just stand in front of it and press R to grab it, then press down to pull. You got it. <gasps> mushroom? Mushroom, mushroom. Oh. <gasps> oh god. Oh, that's cool. That's a cool mechanic. Okay. Oh, look at these guys. Little shrews. Oh, I can't hurt them. Uh, okay. Wow, look at the size of that barrel! Hmm. Oh, right. Right, how silly me. It's not big, we're just small. <laughs> wow. Astute observation there, Mr. Cap. Eslo. Oh. What the heck is this? Whoa. Oh, that's crazy. Oh, so we're gonna have to like rotate the barrel probably to get over there? Ooh. Oh, this is something. It's gotta be something here, right? Oh, wait, can we? Oh, what the heck? I'm changing the floor tiles. Okay, I'm just gonna ignore him for now. Switch. Oh. Oh, okay. Hello. Da -da 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 -da. Oh. I just made the barrel go loose a bit. Uh. What did that do? Oh, maybe now I could actually rotate it. Do something on this side, I guess. Oh, I just have to hit a switch there. For some reason, I didn't think that was a switch. Okay, now it's loose. So now, now maybe I can move it. Oh, there we go. What? Hey, be careful, my lad. The barrel just moved. Oh, this is so cool. I can go that way, but I, there was something down left as well. I think so. I kind of want to go there. <laughs> That's really cool. What is that thing? Oh. Oh, oh, he's dead. Shroom. I don't know if I want to go this way or the other way. I guess we're going to commit to this way. Can I move this block? I cannot. Okay, so that's a one-way block to get out. Okay, so I think this is the right way to go. It's probably going to head back out, and then we're going to go the other way. I wonder if I have to, like, hold this, like, the whole way, or if I could just go, like, a little bit, like... Hmm. Wait, why am I not getting flung over? Oh. Oh, shoot. Whoops. Uh, okay, wait, so... Okay. Uh, so I go that way to get out. Oh, there's a heart piece there. How do I get that? I don't think I can, but I can get that chest though. Okay, so let's get flung all the way up. Yo, five rubies. That's kind of nice. I, I I still love that they kept those messages, like the rupee messages. Hey, you got the map. Light rooms are ones you've wis uh, visited. The blinky rooms is your location. Cool. Nice. Okay. Oh, is this shaped like anything? 
If he maze quest taught me anything, as well as the old, other Zelda games. Oh, it's a mushroom again. Dude, it's- this is just Dungeon 2 in he maze quest. <laughs> it's like, actually almost the same. It's almost exactly the same, actually. It's like, hallway, and then... Yeah, it's like obviously not exactly the same shape, but wow, that's pretty funny. I can't believe they copied Minish Cap, this is unacceptable. Okay, so now the question is, how do I get to that heart piece? There's like another door on the other side. I guess we're gonna check going up here. Do this. More. Go. Uh, I don't have a key, so I guess I gotta go this way? Oh wait, no, that's just this. So I guess we go this way then. Oh, I can't go that way either? What? Oh, shoot. Oh, so I have to go left on that other screen then, probably. Uh, whoops. Can I get there from here? I don't think so. I think I have to go via this. Oh, whoops. <laughs> This switch. Yeah, we need this thing. Uh, so we can't lift it. I think we have to push it, right? Because if we lift it, it's just gonna smash. Okay. Uh, all right. Dude, <laughs> Ezlo won't shut up. Hey, once you take hold of something with R, use this to push your bullet. All right, extremely important. I got it. Uh, can I just push this twice? Oh shoot. Wait, I can fix this. I guess that works. <laughs> hey, we got a key. Alright, can I also just push this? Uh, okay, so now we have the key for that other door. Oh, okay, the door's back. Cool. Examine. It's going up here. Hmm, that's a one-way trip down there. Okay, let's see. This is also a one-way trip potentially though. Oh no, it won't be. Right. Nice. Uh switch. Okay, so we can get back. Uh okay, so then we can do this. I think I'm just gonna eat. I'm gonna go full power on this one. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Uh. What's going on here? That's a lot of slugaroos. can I do this? Uh, huh? I feel like I can't do this yet. Wait, can I? It was on the right side? I'd be able to if it started there. Yeah, I don't think I can do this. 
this yet. This seems sus. Okay, I'm just gonna go north. Oh wait, shit, am I stuck here? That was a one-way trip. Oh no! Okay, so I have to be able to do this somehow, but how? Because I can't... Oh, wait, no. Can I pull? Oh, I'm stupid. Okay, wait. So... Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I don't know why I didn't think I could pull, but... I certainly can. Oh, a little mini boss fight, I guess. Back here, nice. Okay, uh, do this way. I want to get that heart piece I saw from the other room. Hope I can remember where that is again. <sighs> Left or up? Uh, let's see. Wait, what? If I go up, oh, it's a staircase. I'm gonna end up going probably down here. Uh, let's go this way because I think this is where the heart piece is towards. If I can get, the oh, another one. What? There's so many. <gasps> oh no, not these guys again. That door's open forever now. Oh, that's the okay. The main room with the barrel. Okay. Oh, there's a key door as well. Okay, what's the bottom door for? Oh, that's a web. Oh! Oh dear. Uh... Well... We can confront whatever the heck that thing is. The wiggly woo, dude. Alright, I'm using the key here. Oh wait, can I grab it? Attack its face? Oh, yes it can. Oh. Oh god, they're getting angry. Okay, I think I have to like get to it in time. the actual mini boss. Yo, the Gus Jar! Okay, we got our new power up. Hold the button to draw things in and release it to fire them out. Set it to A or B on the I'm just gonna use it. Ooh. Does that mean I could also do it on the webs? Oops. Hey, homes are reforging the sacred blade. Do as the elder says. Oh, yeah, I know that. Okay, so. Oh. And you can shoot it out. Oh. That's neat. Okay, so I can use it on this door. And then get the harpies? Hey. Can I use it on this, like, hay or whatever the heck is going on here? Oh, you can. Ooh. Okay, this is an interesting power up. I can actually use this to like defeat. Oh, and the. Oh god. Oh, I found a switch. <gasps> Yo, 10 mysterious shells. Not sure what they're for, but let's hold on to them for now. Oh. They, like, suck all the life out of the enemy. Oh my god, that's crazy. 
Right now I'm curious if there's gonna be something else in here. This is a cool power up. Oh, another one. <laughs> More shells. This is insane. Dude, this is dangerous. This is just like the shovel from like the other Zelda game where I'm just gonna like I'm gonna just dig or gust jar all of these until I find every little thing. This is dangerous. Ooh, a portal back to the start, I guess. Oops. I keep my hanging slug by accident. For the switches. Uh, okay. So I, I, that probably means I have to go back to the beginning to get to this. I guess. Okay. Um. I guess I could do that right now before I go, because I could just go here to go back to this room, and then. So I'll just go through here. Oh, I can use it on this now, too. So I have a center one. Oops, I keep hitting the wrong button. Interesting. So now where can this take me? Ooh, what's this? Oh, that takes me to death. <gasps> Lily pad. Wait, can I bring this to me? Cool. And then I like push away, I guess. Oh, this is so sick. first maybe Whoa. Uh oh key okay don't have that yet Uh which way I guess we'll take a look at the stairs real quick Yeah there's a thing blocking over there I just gotta... Nope. <laughs> Shoot. Uh... I think I'm still fine. I just gotta not mess this up. Okay. Oh, jeez. I almost messed that up badly. <laughs> I was always gonna summer or front flip into the water and die. It's also kind of cool. Director of this game directed uh, Breath of the Wild and, and Tears of the Game. Oh, really? Uh, that's Al is that Al Numa as well? I think that's who it is, right? Am I? I could be wrong. Oh shoot. Uh, that didn't work. Uh. this side uh, but I can get there right? this probably gets me a key okay I think I saw didn't I just see a key door yeah I was like in the other room could go there before I go upstairs here 
That big chest is also bothering me too. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with that. I wonder... Hmm. If I go through the door here, am I going to lose my lily pad? I might, right? I guess I'll just play it safe and go back now. Okay, that's still there. I knew it was more like Miyamoto with Mario. Oh, gotcha. So... So like the guy who was like, you know, always talking about it to like announce more news about it. Like that's Aonuma, right? That's not the director. Did they do they ever like show what like the direct? Like I don't know if the, I've ever seen the director speak if it's not him. Oh, which way do I go? I guess I have to go up here. Oh, should be able to make this. Wait, I can stand on this, right? Oh. Interesting. Huh. Oh, oh, whoa. Okay. Whoa, that's crazy. Huh. The way that they interact with him is very interesting. Okay. Because this, I probably want to do it from all the way here, right? Ooh, big key. Okay, we're not we're not too far off. Ooh, red teleporter. Oh god. Oh, there's the blue one. So I go get the uh, heart piece and be at four now. <laughs> Sick. Let's go. Perfect timing for before the boss. I think it was interviews pre TOTK. Oh, gotcha. Okay. That's cool, though. I didn't know that. Pretty how cool some of the mechanics are in this game. Yeah, I was kind of, uh, not gonna lie, I was pretty blown away that the, the Gus Jar interacted with that. That's very cool. Oh, there's two doors now. Two doors? To interact with here. So this goes. Is this both? Is this upstairs and downstairs? They're both upstairs to where? I'm not sure, I guess we're gonna find out. Oh, there's the lost door. Uh, so I can go across the room here, but I imagine I could also just go to this room. Oh. Uh. That easy. 20 rupees! Okay. So I have to cross and then I can cross. So I can basically do the boss right now. I can cross there and then cross up. But I wonder if there's anything else I can grab before I do that though. Probably can. So. Because that's the boss. So I've been to every room, apparently. Um. I feel like there was some stuff I haven't done yet, right? Or did I do everything? I don't know, there was that, that one chest. I think it's the compass, though. Probably, right? But how do I do that? Uh, where does this take me again? Where was I just now? Oh, here. Oh, I can't even go back. Wait, no, can I? Oh, I guess I can, but it would, be, it would take a long time. It'd probably be faster to... Cause yeah, there was something in that room. There was a chest in that room, but I didn't know how to do it. Uh... But yeah, I'd have to like basically go backwards from here. Oh, wait, no, no, I can just do this, right? I'll just bonk to the wall. Yeah, okay, that's fine. Oh, no lily pad though. Oh, no. Um, okay. Okay, well, wait, can I just do this? Can I just save and reload and then it'll put me at the start? That's usually how Zelda games work. 
Okay, does this game have soft reset? Let's find out. It does. Okay, cool. Let's go. Alright, this... This should take me back to the start. Sick. Alright. Strats. Um... Okay, but now I want to, like... I want to get that chest, though. So I guess I have to start going... I'll see if I do it pretty quickly, otherwise I'll just go do the boss right now. And then we will probably call it a stream. At the same time we can see if there's anything else we can do with our uh our gust jar. Oh maybe there's gonna be a hidden switch or something here too. <laughs> I just oh I can't just like smack it. Okay. Uh nothing there. Alright, go in the barrel. Alright, here's gotta be something, right? Another shell. Ten shells rather. There's probably nothing here, but I can't help but check. I just have to know. Okay. Um. All right. Now I'm trying to think of like the, what's the fastest way to like get back to. Uh... Oh, I wish I could just go back that way. Uh... Okay. This room I already did all this stuff. Oh, I could just take in the blue portal, I guess, but I wouldn't have found the shell had I not done that. Oh, have I done this room? Wait, this doesn't look familiar. Oh, wait, no, no, no I have done this room. But I don't think I've, I've gone through this with the gust jar, though. Okay, I came from this room from the bottom. Alright, nothing there. This should take me back to the lily pad? Oh no, we're back here. Okay, so how... How do I get this chest then? Oh, the lip had spawned here too. Interesting. Um, can I pull it out? Is it, like I can't. Oh wait, I go like this and like this. Okay. Yeah, there's the compass as expected. Okay, so is there anything else I need to get? Oh, there's a chest in this room. Wait, didn't I get this chest already? Oops, why am I... The chest over here? I got it, though. Oh, shoot. Whoops, I didn't really do that. Uh... Is there another... Oh, I know, on floor one. I'm on floor two, or I'm on B2 right now, so... There's a chest in... This room? There it is. What? Didn't I just check all these things? Wait, what does this do? Oh, what? How did I not get that? What the hell? Okay, I'm just blind, I guess. Uh, okay, I guess I'm ready to do the boss. I guess I'll just have to go the long way. Or no, I guess I could just save and quit again, right? I'll do that real quick. It's probably faster. And then I'll just hit the red. Or not the red, sorry, the... Go to the door and then we're good to go. Yeah, yeah, blah, blah, blah. It's even this game has fast text. I think if you hold B instead of A or like whatever, like the text like clears so much quicker. Wait, let me, let me test this again though. Oh, if I just hold B. Okay, no, so you have to mash B, but still. Um, okay. So I probably want to do this from... Oops, wrong button. No, too far. Here? 
There we go. That should make it across. Perfect. Okay, and then... Oh! Whoops. Alright, cool. Uh, let's go! First boss time! Oh. Or not? Oh! <gasps> Slime. Oh, shit. Oh, he's like, he's normal size, so we're gonna have to fight the, a big version of him. I think I've seen this boss before. Oh god. That's a lot of slimes. Oh my god. Hello! Okay, so... Does that do anything? Oh, I hit him. Whoa! It's doing something clearly, but I'm sure. Okay, I guess I have to just like absorb all his goo. There you go, and then I can. Oh. 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 oh okay, I see. I just have to wait for him to fall. Okay, yeah, I think he just does it on his own. Ah, There's such a huge delay with the. Oh my god, what? He's just mass. He's just spamming jump. Oh god. gonna do it on zone? Uh oh, okay, you gotta bait him. Nice. Got him. This is the earth element apparently? It's Poipole. You got the Earth Element. The power of the Earth is the source of all living things. The Earth Element is the embodiment of that power. Very cool. <gasps> and the heart container, of course. -da -da -da! Your life energy has increased and been replenished. And the portal out of here. Sick. Ah, we've got the Earth Element. We must go tell the Elder at once. Sounds good. All right, I think with that, I'm probably gonna stop here for now then. Uh, yeah, four-hour stream. That seems good. Good stopping point. All right, I'm kind of glad that the dungeon was not as uh, is not, not that long. <laughs> That's yeah, I could probably sneak this in real quick before I stop. Um, yeah, this is really cool so far. I'm I'm loving this. This is great. This is fantastic. Uh, and very very cool first uh, item. Not gonna lie, or power up or whatever you want to call this thing, the gust jar. Really cool. 